Whether you are interested in splitting a long audio file to separate it into tracks or just into more manageable parts, WavePad makes the process easy. Open the file in WavePad and go to the Edit tab. The Split tool is the third button on the toolbar and can also be found in the Edit File menu. You have a few options to choose from. Split at Cursor, Split at Silences, Split at Bookmarks, Split into N equal pieces, Split at Fixed Intervals. This tutorial shows you how to apply each of these options. Additionally, use Split into Component Channels to create a new mono file for each channel in your existing file. Split it cursor is the most basic option. Simply place the cursor where you would like one file to end and the next to begin. Then, click on Split it cursor. You will now have two files on your screen. Remember with all split options that they are not automatically saved. You will need to save your new files. If you have a file that you want split into equal units, for example 5, open the file and select split into n equal pieces. Enter 5 into the text box and click the split button. You now have 5 new files of equal length open in WavePad. If you have a large audio file that you would like to divide into segments of 10 minutes each, select split at fixed intervals. Enter the segment time as hours, minutes, seconds, and milliseconds. I'm dividing this file into 10 minute segments. Splitting a file at silences is also useful. You may have recently digitized a vinyl album or cassette tape and would like it easily divided into tracks. Open the file and select Split at Silences. Use the default threshold and duration, or adjust these numbers for your file. I'm going to use the default threshold and increase the duration to 200 for this file. The final option is Split at Bookmarks. This is useful for files that you want to split at multiple points. However, you have specific points in mind. To create a bookmark, click on the wave window at the specific spot. You can use the play controls and or scrub feature for precise placement. Click the bookmark button on the toolbar or press Ctrl plus B to create the bookmark and enter the bookmark name. Then press OK to save it. Repeat these steps at each split point in your file. Once each position has a bookmark, select Split at Bookmarks. One of the nice features of this option is that your new files are named according to your bookmark name. This makes saving your new tracks easy. For more WavePad tutorials, visit the address shown on your screen.